Hello there, everyone. Welcome to New Heights Wrestling. My name is Jeannie Jem. On this episode, we will see the New Heights Wrestling Pride Championship on the line as the natural 20 Drake Savior takes on a mysterious opponent. Drake was scheduled to fight Bodie O'Hara here tonight. However, Bodie was not cleared for competition. We here at New Heights Wrestling wish Bodie a speedy recovery and look forward to seeing him back in competition soon. Right now, though, our commissioner, Ryan Mills, is heading to the ring. Let's first hear from our sponsors, then we will head down to ringside for this unexpected announcement. Hey fans, it's the man they call Dave with producer Joe, and you probably know us as the commentary team for New Heights Pro Wrestling, but when we're not doing that, we got a podcast. That is the Working Fans Podcast, where we talk pro wrestling, comedy, MMA, and so much more. And tell them about that signature segment. Oh, you talk about the 531? You know I am. That is a homegrown creation that has been our namesake. And if you want to know our namesake, we got Chevy, AJ Strange Brew, as well as the two of us. And why don't you go to our uh, channel, like, subscribe, show us some love. Rate, review, all of it. Hey there, everyone. My name is Jeannie Jem. And if you're enjoying what you're watching here at New Heights Wrestling, please make sure you like, share, and subscribe here on YouTube. You can also find us on other forms of social media, like Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Be sure to share with your friends. Let them see all the exciting action that New Heights Wrestling has to offer. And then I want to hear from you. Put your comments down below. I want to know what you love about New Heights Wrestling. Thank you so much for checking out New Heights Wrestling. And remember to always stay sparkly. Check out the fast-paced action wrestling card game, Go Fight Pow! Create your own intergalactic fight club and play out the results of your own wrestling company, featuring over 100 unique characters and some of wrestling's hottest stars of past and present. The possibilities are endless. Visit gofightpow.fws.store and become a promoter today. It goes down October 19th. Why don't you come on out to the fair at the Walton County Fairgrounds? Walton County Fair. Right in the Ferris wheel! We're gonna be at the actual fair. It's gonna be a fair fight, except first time ever. New High Wrestling and Fades the Walton County Fair. We want to see each and every one of y'all come out and have a good night. Hey, catch what? Fair fight, I'll be there. Fair fight? I don't think so. It's gonna be a fair fight. That's a word from our great sponsors. Now let's go down to ringside. Back here at Aces High, and we have T Gaines making her way out to the ring. I'm the man called Dave, this producer Joe, the Working Fans Podcast. Joe, I'm excited to see what T Gaines has to say. Yeah, due to some unforeseen circumstances, Jody, just Jody, couldn't make it to tonight's number one contender match. T Gaines is number one contender for the NHW Women's Championship. I want to see what her and the Lion Mills have to say out here. Yeah, yeah, I'm excited. T Gaines, one of the great competitors out here in the women's division. And it's unfortunate it's by default, but man, I can't think of a more deserving person to be number one contender for T Gaines. Yeah, T Gaines is excited. It, this whole match was supposed to happen because Emily Locke had that fight with T Gaines after their tag team match wasn't happy with T Gaines, wanted to put another barrier between T Gaines and another shot at Emily's title. Things worked out in T Gaines' favor. The Walton County Fairgrounds is excited about this. We are excited about this. We often talk about how proud we are of the women's division in New Heights Wrestling, always bringing in new superstars to compete. Just debuted that Women's Championship not too long ago when T Games wants to become it is so the second champion. Here. We are, we are so thrilled for her and all that she's done and accomplished here in New Heights Wrestling. And I know we were supposed to have a match tonight for the number one contendership, but unfortunately, Jody could not make it tonight. Her car broke down in route. That's not a joke. That legit happened. And so there is unfortunately no match tonight, but by default, you were the new number one contender for the NHW Women's Championship. 
How many times do people cheer without a default? They love to do this. No. Oh, come on. Resex yeah. Mortis are out of control since Princess Josh won that Anytime Anywhere Championship. going to be oh, yeah. in Kelly's corner and he's going for that title that he is so proud of. What a great opportunity here for Kelly Clark because with T Gaines in his corner that might be able to neutralize Princess Josh. 100%. We know Cerise X Mortis likes to get involved but don't count Drake Xavier out. We talked about the increasing ego with Cerise X Mortis and I don't think Drake is going to want to lose any momentum that they have with these championships around their waists. Absolutely. And you know, we can talk about the outside interference of Princess Josh and T Gaines, but at the end of the day, Drake Xavier and Kelly Clark are two of the biggest, brightest talents we have here at New Heights Wrestling. Yes, two of the most athletic superstars yes. that could get in the ring, so the Walton County Fairgrounds is getting a treat in this surprise match here. Right now in the air, that electricity, that championship feeling. The crowd's excited. Kelly is one of their favorites. You can see the signs in the crowd there. Yeah, you can see Drake Xavier frustrated already. Drake did not want this. Kelly reaching Whoa. out to T Gaines. Drake Whoa. trying to take an advantage, catching those chops in the corner. And Kelly had eyes behind his head there. And look at that, the crowd just loves Kelly here. Firing Drake into the opposite corner, reversal. reversal. Kelly Hook gets to the face. Speed up. Yeah, absolutely, here again. Kelly's such a student of the Woo. game. He 
he has been watching his matches with Drake to try and evaluate what he could have done better yeah. in that loss. He might have that answer with Kelly uh, having T Gaines out there in this corner. Seeing numerous Kelly Clark signs in the crowd here. They're firmly behind this young man. Needed the mid midsection from Drake. Ooh, Drake dumps him. Oh, look oh. at Kelly. Holding on. Maybe a little skin in that cat. cat. Yeah. Head scissors Drake over the top here. Back into the ring. What a young talent this man is. Bouncing off the ropes. Basement slide. Catches Ooh. Drake right in the chest. You can see the effects of this beating on Drake's chest so far. Princess Josh looks rattled himself right now. And Drake's Saber, oh, there's T. Gates. Drake doesn't oh. know where he's going. Young fans right up front there for Mr. Personality. Ooh. Could, in fact, one of these young fans be inspired to wrestle from Kelly Clark like Kelly Clark had been inspired from Cali Man oh. Rake in the back of Drake Xavier there. Josh shouting encouragement at Drake and yelling at the cameraman to get back. Princess Josh, Drake Xavier both look rattled. Kelly breaking up the count there, rolling Drake into the ring. Kelly looks focused though. Oh. Rolling into the ring. Oh, oh, look at that. Josh has oh. the feet. Ref T. Gates trying to get the ref's attention. But she's dealing with Drake. Oh, oh dropping that elbow right on between the shoulder blades there. And that's the art of the distraction, right? Just that little bit of time was enough. And it was that point of the elbow, too. And now standing on Kelly's neck on those ropes, possibly trying to cause a cauliflower ear with the pressure there. Drake Xavier has turned this around just like that Josh, due to the help of Princess Josh. Josh holding up their arms, trying to act like they're innocent. Kelly getting to his feet oh, on the outside. Oh, there's another sucker shot. And Drake keeps distracting the ref right after abuse. I'd say abusing that five count. Kelly kicking out at one there. Yeah. Kelly checking his face. I almost wonder if he's bleeding, I think. Turning to that rear chin lock is Drake really driving that knee further behind those shoulder blades. Clapping the ears of Kelly Clark here. Oh. That's got to not only hurt, but frustrate Kelly Clark. Yeah, Kelly trying to summon the crowd to give him the will to get up here. Drake has that advantageous position. Kelly to his feet, yes. elbows to the midsection. Drake that separation. Oh. oh, pulling the hair of Kelly Clark there. Drake Xavier not afraid to take a shortcut as we've seen before. Oh. I think he thinks he's the next Pride champion. You definitely see that frustration is still there, Drake Xavier. Yeah, when we interviewed Drake Xavier a while ago, he was much more subdued, but now won't even look at us in the locker room. We've seen just a definite attitude change, and that attitude change has 100% translated to the ring. Look at the way he's treating the fans here. Yeah, no doubt the egos are out of control. Big chop to the chest of Kelly Clark. You can see Drake just really taunting the fans after he's chopped too. Well, you always say oh. that championships make somebody 30% better, 30 I believe it was. Better, yes. How much does it inflate the ego? What are the percentages on that? <laughs> Roll up. It's near fall. Oh! No. The boot! The heel of that boot yeah. right on Kelly Clark's chin. The athleticism of Drake Xavier to get up in time and hit Kelly with that. Impressive. Kelly was first sold in his head, then his back, and now just raining that yeah, ground and pound on Kelly Clark. Here. Crowd letting him know what, he, what they think, but he's just telling yeah. them where they can go with it. Unbelievable. Drake Xavier. He is not letting up on his crowd tonight. He's a little fed up that the crowd is more behind Kelly than him. He has shown just as much athleticism, gotten arguably as many wins, and now the gut wrench suplex. Yes. Going up, coming oh. down on that back again. Well executed. Mocking the crowds, yeah. clapping there. Hey, Kelly. Kelly. If anybody can summon the crowd, it is Mr. Personality. 
struggling to his knees. Drake getting that front face lock. Picking him up. Throwing the arm over. Are we looking at... Oh, delayed vertical suplex here. Letting that blood rush to the head. Absolutely. Look at that. That's power. Oh, reversal oh. by Kelly, though. Into a backslide, perhaps? Drake resisting here. Trying to fight it with all his weight. Kelly turning. Down to one knee. Gets the advantage there. Oh. Pin Drake rolls out it, too. Boot to the midsection. Front face lock of his own. Neck breaker. Oh! That was devastating. Big snap neck breaker. Going, Going for the pin. pin. Drake kicking out at two. Here from Kelly, Kelly, Kelly thought it was three. There's a certain intensity tonight about Kelly Clark we haven't seen. Holding the back of his head, but getting in the corner. And we know what he's lining up for here. Waiting for Drake to get to his feet. Going for the super kick. Drake catches him. Electric chair into the bridge. Look at that. Kicking out at two. Kelly still holding on. It is really taking everything Kelly has to kick out of that. We have seen how much Drake has gone to that back for damage. Princess Josh, I rate on the floor. Drake appears to be set him in the corner though here. Stopping that chest. Oh, oh both feet. feet. Yes. Using every bit of that five count. Princess Josh talking trash to Kelly Clark here. Uh we know what this is. Magical missile oh. into the corner. Hits all of it. Kelly could be out. Kelly looks out on the mat. Look at Josh continuing to berate Kelly right in his face. Drake dragging yes. Kelly to the middle of the ring here. Let's go over that pin. Look at the leg. Oh, Kelly oh, kicking out at two out. and a half there. He dragged Kelly to the middle of the ring to probably avoid Kelly from getting his foot on the ropes, but might have been just enough time because Kelly was just able to get that shot. Would T Gaines have dared to break the rules and pull him out there? Raining down punches from that ground and pound again. We see the frustration in Drake's face here. What more does he have to throw at Mr. Personality to finish this off? Still talking down to Kelly. Oh, right hand. Well, that looked like it fired up Kelly a little bit. Cast shades of his idol from the 80s oh. there. That still fired up. Eating those punches. Oh. oh, man. We're seeing all sorts of references here from deep in wrestling history. Blocking the punch. Giving him a right. And a third. Drake looking loopy on the ropes. Kelly fires him off. Reversal. Oh! Big DDT on the top of Drake's head. Drake looking very glassy-eyed right now. Kelly in the corner once again setting up for that super kick. Josh on the apron. Look out. We knew this was going to happen. Getting the ref's attention. Two guys has had enough. Pulls Josh off the apron. Josh getting in T-Gain's face. Big oh. slap! She is not having any more of that. Oh, oh, no! While all this was going on, the ref was distracted, did not see the low blow from Drake Xavier. Now she sees what's going on. T-Gain's is trying to tell the ref, but the ref can't call what the ref doesn't see. There is so much chaos going on, and that will follow the Paladin of Chaos here. Oh, he already hit that low blow. Drake setting up. Oh, right wow. on Kelly's head. Pin, hook in the leg. This is over. That was Akabel at that point. The low blow set that whole thing up. Drake Xavier taking advantage of the chaos, if you will. Princess Josh continuing to get in T-Gain's face. Drake Xavier just posing in the middle of the ring. Goes out of control. Yeah. T Gain's very upset. And I think Josh and Drake Xavier are just happy to get out of this ring with their championships here. Yeah. Well, 
all I'll tell you, we are thinking of Bodhi. Hopefully he gets better yes. soon and really finally good. gets that champion, that chance to go after the Pride Championship. He's going to have to keep an eye because Drake Xavier does not want to lose it. Princess Josh doesn't want to lose that anytime, anywhere championship. And you're not going to want to lose sight of New Heights Wrestling. Remember, use that hashtag NHWPro. You can find New Heights Wrestling on all social media platforms, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, Twitter. Drop us a line. Let us know who your favorite superstar is. But most importantly, thank you for joining us. Good night, everybody.